back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Bernice, and if you are a returning viewer, then thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So I'll be showing you guys how to do this eye look. So I finished my face makeup because I want this to be strictly a quick and easy eye makeup tutorial. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and let's get started. So if anybody was wondering what in the world is on my head, um, I'm laying my edges. Well, this look isn't ready without my edges being done. So I'm first going to start off by warming up my eyes with my number seven bronzer in shade caramel or caramel. I don't know how to say it. I, I really don't know. <laughs> so I'm just putting this right on my crease just to give it some depth. I like to do circular motions right here because it gives a natural contour to the nose. I like to kind of swoop it upwards because that really gives it a little bit of lift. And if you've seen my previous video, which I will probably put in the top left corner. I think it's the left corner or the right corner, I forgot. Um, but before I set my face with my contour shade, I put it right here under all of this to give it that lift. This is just setting that and enhancing that color. So I don't remember if I mentioned about my new brushes, but I got some new brushes from Best Besto. Let me see. Yes. Apparently it's called Besto. I got this in this beautiful color. I love this because it just feels so fancy. <laughs> but I have actually been trying out the brushes on the eyes and I actually really, really like it. I'm surprised because with hooded eyes you kind of want to get smaller brushes, but these have been working perfectly fine. So I'm first going to start off with with Hennessy by the Fenty Beauty Moroccan Spice Palette. I'm going to be using this color. This one is a dark brown. So, ah! I'm literally always dropping my brushes. I'm going to take this color with this flat brush. This really helps get into the corner. Always want to tap out the excess. So I'm kind of tilting my head backwards just so I can clearly see where my bone is. So I put the color in the right placement. My bone is right here. I'm going to put this on the outer corners and I'm going to go right under where my bone is. Let's go down from there. The key with this is following your natural bone structure because you're trying to enhance your eye shape. I'm kind of doing a, a V that's going this way. And as you can see, for my hands at the end of the brush so that I have more control on how much color I'm putting in here. You really just want to keep blending until you get that look that you want. This kind of dirt, <laughs> I don't know what it's called, but a dirt brown, but it's from the number 10 palette. It's a different shade of brown, it's a lot lighter, but it's really good for giving definition on the eye. So I'm going to be putting this right here right on my crease with the same brush because I have hooded eye I can kind of be messy on here because when I look straight forward you can't even see it and also I'm gonna bring down this color a little bit lower because I want my eyes to look a little bit smaller a little bit more lifted. I can bring this shade a little bit down here.
now to blend everything out you can go back with Hennessy go over this so you could also go with this angle brush and just to blend that out some more now I'm gonna be adding the color Hennessy right under my eyes and because I want to be really really light with this I'm putting my my fingers kind of towards the end of the brush because I don't want it to be too much I just wanted to blend really nicely you can add some more if you want just build up to the intensity that you want now I'm gonna be taking this shimmery brown shade this is in the color shisha smoke and I'm just putting a little bit because I don't want it to look too much really brings intensity to the eye it puts the whole look together so I'm gonna get a little bit closer for this because I want you guys to see the eyeliner I like to use a liquid and a pencil liner so everything that I'll be using today will be in the description box below but for now I'll be using the fallible super slim liquid eyeliner in shade black and then the elf black pencil liner I'm first gonna start off with putting a line, really, really thin line because we're gonna be blending this out. Oh my goodness, get out of my way. <laughs> so I'm gonna go on a straight line. Now I'm gonna take this brush and just gently blending this out we're just gonna keep blending this out until we get that smoky look I'm gonna go and follow my natural line in the inner corner because mine kind of goes down I'm gonna go down some people's eyes go more of like um, a cylinder shape right here and extends more this way. So you would put the line following that. To connect that here, I'm gonna be filling in my waterline with the black pencil liner. I'm gonna be taking this brush that comes with, it's an um, eyebrow brush, but since it's really small, thin and angled, I'm gonna use this to clean whatever I messed up. To get a sharper look. Now I'm going to be taking my e.l.f. pencil liner and filling in my waterline, both the top and the bottom. So now that I'm done with this, I'm going to finish the other eye and then put on my mascara really quick. I'm using the Lash Princess Mascara. Um, this is the shit. I don't know. It's the best <laughs> mascara I have ever tried. Anyways, I'll be right back guys so I'm back I all I did was put on some mascara and I did the other eye so now because I wanted to do I was I was thinking about not doing this but <clears throat> 
So I'm going to be using my number 7 powder blusher in apricot blossom. And I'm be taking this brush and putting just a little bit. So I'm putting this right on my cheekbone, right on top of my contour. This look is not finished without the highlight. So as usual, I'm going to be taking the Kilowatt palette by Fenty Beauty and I'm taking the shade Stone Cold right here. This is my go-to highlighter <laughs> if y'all have seen my previous videos. So I'm putting this right on my brow bone. Now I'm taking the fan brush and I'm putting this on the bridge of my nose. I'm also putting some of my Cupid's bow. Taking the NYX Matte Lip Liner in shade Cold Brew. I'm going to take the Diamond Milk Gloss Balm by Fenty Beauty on top of that. Okay guys, and I'm done. <laughs> See, I think this is one of my go-to going out makeup just because it's so easy, but it really it's so beautiful i love it and i hope you guys enjoyed it as much as i enjoyed it don't forget to leave me any suggestions like comment and subscribe and thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in my next video bye